Hi everybody, today we're going to talk about the Olympia Maxi. This is a 25 year old machine, believe it or not. And we had to replace quite a lot of parts to get it up and running again. So it's ready, it's been on for a few hours. Uh, we pulled a lot of shots just to make sure it's working fine. The machine is great, but before we demonstrate how it works, we're going to talk about what we did. So first of all, we tuned up the machine, which means uh, replacing the screen and gasket of the group head right over here. Uh, descaled the machine. We actually had to replace the entire heating element because it was bad. Have it right over here, the old one. I have to just take a look how it looked like. Not a pretty sight, but it's better to know that this thing is out, out of your uh, espresso machine rather in it. Uh, and you can like literally look at the bottom, see it was leaking, it was really old and rusty. So we have a brand new one, we totally cleaned the in inside of the boiler, um, rewired the bottom and we also like removed all the rust from the bottom cover and repainted it. Um, we have to replace, we had to replace the boiler cap, this little guy. It also has a safety valve. I want to show you the old one. So this old one, if I'll just zoom in here, you see it's cracked and it's really it's not safe to use something like that. So we got a new one in there and then we replaced this team spindle. So it was leaking and it was kind of hard to find but we found it at um, Stefano's in New York. So this is the old one again. And this thing, this whole spindle is inside here. Replaced the whole thing, cleaned it up. We had to de deep clean the steam wand. And the last one is this pressure stat. You can see this is the old one again. You can see it's like really mechanical. You have all these things and all the wires here. And it was also not functioning right. The new one inside looks just like that. So it's more efficient and it's brand new. So it's going to serve you well. Uh, anything else? No. Uh, we pulled several shots, like I said, and we had a really good time enjoying it. First of all, let's just see how the steam works. Oh. So we have really good steam coming out of the machine. If you like drinking latte, that's great for you. It also has a decent sized boiler inside, so that's very satisfying. Um, Alright, we're using Verve Coffee today. And I also I want to mention it is very important to make sure you lock tight the body filter and I'm just gonna zoom in here. Watch it. Here we go. That was fast. We've got great espresso. You can keep going and going. This machine has actually heat exchanger, which means uh, the water that you get to your espresso not coming directly from the boiler. It's coming from a water tank here. So only what the boiler provides steam, and the water goes through the boiler, heating up, and then goes out. So you can keep filling your water and keep steaming your milk. So this is a very efficient machine. Um, and it provides a lot of coffee, so that's really good if a lot of people use it. Uh, and it's a really tiny machine, so I think it's well built. And that's it, so thank you for watching and thank you for repairing with Canaan Coffee.